Right, right side, three ball on the way from Polanski. He's a brick rebound, Jade Geif. That almost got wedged between the bas basket and the backboard. Pollinger to the front court. Kara drives, now dishes out Membrano. Alex picks up her dribble, tries to go to Bauer. Audrey baseline, fires it up from 18. Got it. Audrey Bauer from 18 feet with a nice play. Off the dribble. Mids leading by a count of 2 nothing. Takes some bad shots. Mids got to make some things happen themselves. They go to Guy for the post. Jade kicks it left side. Bauer, she'll fire a three left wing. Bang! Inside out, Guy for the dime. Bauer the tray. 5-2 Navy at 17-07. Hung looks in the post. They swing it left side. Edwards, she'll fire the left wing three. That's too strong. Rebound, Arvin. Beautiful square off there by Shy. She brings it up the floor on the run for the Mids. Had Bauer run in the floor. Picks up her dribble. Up top, Membrano. Alex, straight away. Three ball. Bang! 8-2, mids at 16-33. Alex Membrano with a tray. Shai Arvin creating the play in transition. And here's the double. Steps through it to Pollinger. Beautiful ball fake. Gets hung in the air. Pollinger to the elbow right side. Geif down low. Jade puts it up and in. Beautiful job by Pollinger to be patient. Draw the defense and then dish to Geif for the easy bunny. 10-4, mids at 15-53. Polans pivot move. Brings it up against the press. Dribbles by two. Down the lane. Bounce pass. Guy play up good. Pollinger putting on a show early at 15.06. Mids have doubled up the Tigers. It's 10 or 12.6. In the middle of the floor, Rashid puts up the runner. Deadens against the rim. No good. Rebound inside for Bauer. Bauer hacked that by Rashid from behind. Princeton just doesn't let you breathe. Even if you get the rebound, they turn around and put pressure on you. Membrano gets Edwards on her hip. Drives to the goal. Puts it up and in. The many ways Alex Membrano can attack you, and she showed it right there. We know she can shoot. Looking for Guy down on the box. Jay skips it out. Edwards, Aaron, three ball on the way. Bang. 17-11, Navy the lead back to six as Guy again plays inside out. Membrano across the top of the key, looking to drive. Picks up her dribble outside Pollinger. Kara drives into the lane, challenges Bowen, left it short. Geif inside with the rebound, back up for two. Jade Geif, the offensive rebound on the putback. Navy back on top, 19 to 17. Inside Membrano, Alex Ball fakes, splits the double, try to go give and go with Penley. Hollinger picks up the loose ball, ties it up with a three at 5, 55. Navy now, four of eight from three point range. Three for six here early. Bauer tries to answer straight away and does. We're tied at 25. This is good basketball. 5.08 to go, 25 all time. Audrey against Rashid, tries to go up and under, bounces back door Stapleton, no call. Geif the offensive rebound, back up and in. Mids by two, 27-25 at the four minute mark. Lobs it down low, Jade is there, makes the catch, blocked by Edwards. Geif gets it back, kicks it out. Stapleton baseline three, bang! Jade Geif does it again, inside out for three, 30 to 25. The mids by five as the freshman knocks down the big shot from the perimeter. Geif, Jay, one-on-one -on -one inside against all good. Back it in with five. Jay, up and under with the left hand. Yes. Jade Geif going to work in her office. Unofficially with Aaron Edwards off the inbound. Finds Membrano right at the box, and she lays it up and in. After the timeout, beautiful play drawn up by Stephanie Pepper. 34-30, the mids by four. Mids have sixth post for Bowen with two. Bowen right hand jump hook at the buzzer is good. So the Mids with a chance to go up six at the end, give away the ball, and they go in up by two. 34 32 at the break. Early by Rashid. Arvin bounces in the post for Bauer. Audrey turn around. Yes. Hit the back rim, went up in the air high, and came back through. And on the right wing with 10 on the shot clock, tries to split a double team. Goes to the ground, kicks it back to Edwards. Aaron, crossover dribble move, puts up the runner. Got it to go. Wow. Tough shot, Aaron Edwards. Shot clock winding down. 42-39, Princeton by three with 11.36 to go. Appreciating time, trying to score in the half court in the second half. Membrano squares up against Smith. Looks to go baseline. Spins back to her left hand, fall away. Oh, what a tough shot. It looked like Smith may have even got a piece of that shot. And Membrano hits it anyway. Mids back within one at 42-41. 10-20 to go. Pollinger had Membrano leaking through. Lavender ball fakes. Membrano left side. 18-footer. Money. 
It's a bad shot in a way because she's two inches from a three-pointer, but the mid's tied up at 43. You'll take it. Pollinger with five. Kara to the baseline, forces it up, wouldn't go in. Penley alive to Geif, back up and in. Jen Penley keeping it alive for Jade Geif. And the layup gives Navy a two-point lead with 8.35 to go. Brings it to the left side, has Geif there, they give it to Jade. Jade holding, going to roll into the lane, back it down, Bowen fall away off the glass for two. Out of Fort Gay, West Virginia, around a Geif screen. Kara comes back near side. Guy posting up down there against Bowen. They get it into her. Jade is free. Lays it up and in. Pollinger with a beautiful entry pass against the Bath or the Bowen overplay. And the Mids lead by three, 49 46, seven minutes to go. Shoot it up. Bauer left side. Edwards with a lane. Kicks it back. Pollinger three left of the key. Bang! How big has Kara Pollinger's development been for this basketball team? Navy by six with 5.32 to go. The confidence for the kids in blue and gold rising tonight. Shooter on the year, now 10 of 13. Second, no, off back iron. Rebound comes out to Edwards. Ball loose on the ground. And Membrano's going to get the loose ball. Alex finds Geif underneath. Jade layup, yes! With 38.1 to go. That may do it here in Annapolis. The mids by 11. Hung to Dietrich. Mids playing D right to the end here. Dietrich shot short. Pollinger the rebound. Dribbles underneath, and with seven seconds to go, Princeton will not foul. And the Navy bench rises. Stephanie Pepper shaking hands with Jeff Ferrata, and the Mids are going to win it here tonight by a count of 65 to 52. This is as big a regular season win the Navy women's program has had in a long, long time, especially non-league. Unbelievable ball game from the kids here in the second half. They took a big haymaker from Princeton at the start of the second half, and they win it here tonight by a count of 65-52. We're back with the happy Northrop Grumman postgame show in a moment on the Navy Radio Network. Annapolis has the Mids with a significant regular season win in an awful long time for this program as they knock off 7-1 Princeton here tonight, 65-52. They improve to 6-3. Welcome to the North of Grumman postgame show. Joined now by basketball version of the Secretary of the Interior, Jay Geif. You know, after Wednesday night, kind of ironic, two years in a row against Sienna, two points and seven rebounds. Tonight, against this caliber of competition, talk about the way your teammates work so hard, even deep into the shot clock at times, to find you in the interior and to get the big buckets you got late. Because the first seven minutes of the second half, you guys had three points. At that point, what changed for you all that you guys got your offensive confidence back and started to execute once again? Well, it's just, honestly, it's just trust in each other. Um, whenever I get double on the inside, I'm ready to kick it out. You know, knowing that my teammate's going to make that shot, even at the end of the shot clock, even if it's a tough shot, you know, just trust in each other, just confidence in each other. That's truly all that it is. You know, um, that's that's what it happened, and we and we are fired up to win this game. That's for sure. I was going to say this is a terrific basketball team you played tonight, and relentless pressure. You knew you were going to need some big performances from people all throughout the game. But even talk about the the contributions people like Chloe Stapleton, Chantel Lavender gave you all some huge minutes there, especially defensively. Oh, uh, and, and then the second half of this game, Jen came in again and, and gave you all some good interior defense. Talk about those kind of contributions. They sometimes get lost in the box score in a game like this, but obviously huge. Numbers. It is so huge. I, I don't know if you remember this play, but I did get blocked down low, and then uh, I got it and kicked it out to Chloe, just being, just hoping she made that, knowing she made that, and she just switched that. And it was such, you know, it's such a confidence booster. Even though I did get blocked, it was like, yes, you know, I, my teammates are there. And, you know, having Jen come off the bench and having Shani, that's huge. Having her, that defense play fired the whole team up. Like, we were ready to play some good D. I was going to say, too, 